Uh, all right, my people. Good morning. Um, new updates, things going on uh, in the world of sports over here. Brilliant, brilliant stuff. Of course, yesterday, um, the kind of things you're witnessing in our Europa League in the middle makes it very, very important. So we'll come here, have conversations with you. And that has a lot of implications, pa. If you're a Chelsea fan, if you're a Manchester United fan, and possibly playing in Europe in T. Um, we'll talk about all of those things. We'll dig deeper. Uh, we'll explain everything. As you did, did the own common in our office, Manfred on YouTube. Here, as if you Manfred on YouTube, you know, say over here, it's your best, 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 best football tactical analysis um, um show. So don't go one way away. Post match analysis, pre match analysis, not be beer up things, the various stories. No, I, if you Manfred, I bring it to you here. On Fifi Manfred on YouTube, and um, I'll remind you again if you're not subscribed to the channel, then it's important. Pa, say you pause the video, you go back and subscribe to the channel, subscribe to the channel, no? and turn on the notifications. Turn about you are first to get everything that we get, we, we put out, out here in the notification. You know? Make sure you don't choose all if every Fifi Manfred this Fifi Manfred on YouTube. I am committed, so I'll give you the best of footballing preview, post my preview, tactical analysis everything make sure say you also are here every time and one of the things i want you to do for me is this over that's a weird love of the content i'm sure share the content share the content in good be a woman make sure so you share the content and every other person here or around no is also going to enjoy and say thank you to you god bless you say oh yes sorry and make sure so you share the link now we'll be at in the and nijuma oh hold on nice 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 stuff for let's start with 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 just the Europa League stories, you know, we'll delve into the proper analysis now with time. So, we, I was saying, and, and I did see in the um, head and I said, a lot of things are going to influence. Even in Chelsea, it's Michel, because also Premier League table now, Chelsea are just about a couple of points away from uh, European places. Seventh place, a bit more than Chelsea, a boy in Europe. Um, also, the number of games, are it means that it's, it's a possibility that so Chelsea can play in Europe again. Um, so, Osha, Chelsea can also win a FA Cup, then they'll go and play in Europa League. But we'll put that aside, we'll concentrate on the things that hinge on the league team, the Europa League um, positions. No? Um, if you go to the Premier League and then you look at a table like that, uh, it is very clear that Chelsea have a good chance of going to go and play in Europe this season. But that may not be possible. Even if Chelsea makes the mark as it stands now, like it, don't come on. it may not be possible. And that's one of the reasons in tell you this and come on in the way of if you manfred on YouTube in the app, you don't have to go away. But you see, just before we come to that, now, let's go into the Europa League and then talk about the things that happened in the Europa League and then yesterday in the First of all, see shocking results for Atlanta should be free back down every July Stadium one then fly to the Anfield. I mean, we all know the Anfield. The BIA didn't come out. We tell you say it is a fortress, and of course, it is a fortress in terms of Liverpool, Liverpool European Knights, or oh, no. in terms of Liverpool turning things around. In terms of Liverpool, it pushed it towards winning the league. You know, during the COVID era, Anfield in recent times have still had that um, um, that 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 vociferousness now. A stadium that's supposed to be feared us, and it's the criteria of everything that the people of Liverpool want to see. Anytime that they play in Europe and even in the league. Now, see, Gasparini had in the boys the Bauer and Rana, though, and they made mockery of it. I was surprised. See, I am somebody that believes in Atlanta and in Gasparini. The day I was really convinced about Gasparini, I mean, I've seen him before. He has been in the Italian game for a very long time. He's a top manager on him, Nejuma. And at the, in the times, you know, you see Jim City more team called minus small and taking over the Italian Serie A by storm. You know? I was wondering, who is this man? So I did some good research on him. He's a top manager in um, 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 Thiago Mota book. If he is of you know, the value of the ball. You know? He made reference to Gian Gianluca Gasparini for a couple of times. And he tells you, say he's a quality manager. But you can be quality. It's my quality manager. It's my top guy. It's my good coach. But so do players know a free Bergamo in the northern part of Italy and then bringing them to the northern part of England in Liverpool and then beating them and beating them well. It takes something else more than tactics. It takes a lot of confidence, a lot of ego, a lot of willpower, a lot of hard work. So, with me, I achieve these results now. 
um, Atlanta for TV and Rana Journal. It is a huge result for Atlanta. This is normally we see just about three times of year. I think one or twice to two of the top teams in uh, um, Italy, uh, International Milan 2 1 no, and, a, and, a, and a few other ones. That's all. Indeed. Yes, you talk about say, okay, they win more when they go out, but I feel so their performance may not be good, but they are very solid. You don't lose so much when they play at home. And Liverpool say, quite away to beg to go and beat them. It's going to be a big thing. I mean, it is going to be a huge, 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 huge thing for, for Liverpool to be able to turn to tie down. If they do, it's going to come down to character of Liverpool being because, of course, we've seen that Liverpool are a top, top team in Europe and they've shown how things are done. Three back yesterday from Atlanta, tall teamer, uh, your friend of Liverpool are uh, uh, into shirts. They show them how good they are in everything that they wanted to do. So we'll see how that return league goes on. Also, Another English Premier League team, West Ham United, Echo are waiting by 04 Liverpool in the Bay Arena and they lost by two goals to zero. First up, next 0 0. Um, very resolute defensive performance from David Moyes' team, you know. But as time went on, they were not able to do their job. Crap. They lost it, they lost con concentration. Things weren't easy for them as the game went on. And Victor Boniface, Eddie Jonas Hoffman made it two goals to zero for Tima. Their friend of Bayer Lever So uh, it, it's difficult. I think that what was really um, telling in all of those performances and in the show at the Bay Arena was when Nigerian brother, your friend of um, Victor Boniface, actually go, he scored a second goal, no career, the Mohammed Kudu sitting celebration, telling Mohammed Kudu, Hi, me fear you may have be the star boy, but what we do as a warrior, and I may be a star boy, you know. That was the Bay 04 Arena. In the um, Bay Liverpool, St. Javier Lonso, the unbeaten round keeps on going on. Um, David Moore is still anti man for the side, no Anko Anko Shomo in Europe. Difficult spell for Torian uh, for um, West Ham United. Some people with 10 legs, you know, that was um, the Liverpool, the um, London Olympic Stadium. You see, social Liverpool, and team. Uh, all the things you have to understand is that when teams play like how Liverpool play, so push a lot of men forward uh, in your attack, in your final third, uh, just so you have a lot of numerical superiority when you want What you have to also do is say uh, your counter press has to be scripts, and that's exactly the idea. Um, Xavier Alonso, a uh, the counter press, no, a uh, top notch into every time then he plays in the push a to go and create chances and score. Uh, when they lose the ball, they're aggressive with a counter press and then they win the ball and they play for it. That's exactly what they did. And I ended up almost being a very, very good win. It will feel against West Ham United. David Moore is any David Mohamed Kudus. Um, they didn't have anything to sniff on. We went to see how that return leg in the back of the London Olympic Stadium. Then two other games, of course. The so first one, um, uh, yeah, um, 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 yeah, I can't tell you the Italian derby in the course, you know, AC Milan versus um, Roma. Roma about one goal to zero against AC Milan away. Oh, Milan. I mean, it was a shocking result in my opinion. AC Milan on very, very good form. Um, and I felt that they should be able to have won that game. We're having almost a full score, but they weren't able to do that. Um, you're wondering how the away leg is going to go like. And then finally, Benfica, Etnafi, Eshe, Marseille. Two goes to one, but a big one for me in the AAP, Marek Obama Young. I'll share the first, the 10th goal in the European season in the Europa League this season. This was a play I know all struggle power Chelsea to get goals this season. He has scored quite a number of goals. In fact, every Chelsea player be on a struggle at Chelsea last season is getting the goals in Europe and even at home. It, uh, it tells you, make your deductions from all of those things. No? Um, that's up to you. I will make my Yes, I see. The results of the Champions League, you know, results of the Europa League, any results of the Conference League will have a huge effect on if said Chelsea beating Melbourne. Euro next season. Now, I told you about the league standards. The BL Chelsea, that's Siano. Chelsea are very close. I think just about three or four points away from seventh place and eighth place and then sixth place and stuff like that. In the Chelsea, it's been a good win from now to the end of the season. Chelsea has a very, very high likelihood so they can play in Europe. Now, the problem is not that. The problem is that because of Champions League, now they are extending the number of teams in the community. So, Bekaya. Instead of 32 teams that won a Champions League, we have a 36 team now. 
So Europe has a coefficient system, a Europe file coefficient system. They are giving one extra slot to two teams on average coefficient in AI. Uh -huh. That's where you don't understand. I'm coming there. First of all, and then it's our average coefficient. You know, how does it affect the team? I told you again, about the Champions League qualification. Champions League is increasing the number of teams never born. It's because of science, you know. You for I say we will need four more teams to come play in the Champions League. The first two slots, you remember, out of European teams never born in Europe, no. Our average coefficient, no, maybe increase it. Top two, no, maybe one more. Indeed, Italy, England, Spain, Germany, France, all the other leagues. I mean, in whatever order. So, when your teams never come very far, it means that you get coefficient, they will get some points and a uh, cumulative points uh, for the league. You know, if you are the best league in terms of people coefficient, uh, you will get if you are the second best league in terms of people coefficient, you get one more slot. And it's in a see so what this season almost every person be a or yeah, um. In English, you know, you pandits, we are keep on telling you that there's a possibility a fifth place will play in Champions League this season. In team, teams be the or most many as then will be around fifth and fourth place. I will go back and forth. They know that they can play in Champions League next season, which is very likely. And then, of course, it means that Sebasa, the other guys that will play in Europe, no, will be set in seventh in there. So, um, Manchester United, this position now, I think it is uh, Newcastle or Bournemouth or something also there. Possibility the choices we could do and they can also play in Europe, but there is a reason why that may not happen, and the reason is simple. You see, as all shared champions league, man. in fact, right now, in terms of UEFA coefficients, no, team or that's your power, a Italy, I mean, league that's your a Italy. So it means that the league and this is here, Italy are going to get one more slot. So out of the four teams that qualify for you, one more team is going to qualify for the champions league over Italian Serie A. The second team is here in Germany. Now, Italy points are what accumulative average um, coefficient on you know, 18,428. The coefficient you know. then Germany, it was 16,785. Now, England and a third, it was 16,750. Then there is Spain, 15,062. Oh, then there is France, there is Belgium. Um, there is um, Turkey, Portugal, and the Netherlands in that order. Now, you discuss this new year. First of all, so Italy, and then Italy has our point to it. Because Italy, the last team I know what champions team we were through, that was International Milan, FM. Now, that's not an issue. It doesn't matter, say, who are you for league, who are you champions team, who are you Europe and as a conference team. The points in the Champions League, the points in the Europa League, the points in the Conference League doesn't really differ. In this, will be more teams in Conference League. It doesn't differ. And then, oh, so we'll more points in the Champions League. You get so we'll more teams in the Champions League. You get more points than a league or more teams in the Europe in the in the Conference League or the Europa League. You understand what I'm saying? In this, now me part say, Italy don't have anybody in the Champions League as it stands now. But because there are more teams. In the Europa League now, any conference league, you know, they seem to be going up. Now let's look at the number of English teams that were Europe. Now Liverpool, Europe, West Ham, were Europe, Aston Villa, were Europe, Man City, were Europe, Aston, were Europe, five, Liverpool, um, um, Italy, our Florentina, our Europe, Roma, our Europe, AC Milan, our Europe. All of these teams, three, our Europe as it stands now. Atlanta, so our Europe, four teams, our Europe as it stands now. Now you look at um, um, Germany, Germany or barely but close, you know, Dortmund or Bayern or uh, who else is in Europe for Germany or Europe or um, Dortmund, Bayern or Europe or and then barely but close in Central Europe. Then we'll have to make a very quick cross check on teams that are all in the European Conference League, you know, um, and so then we can see who is in Europe as well in the various teams now? Which of them um, is in Europe uh, now? Of course, which teams was now? Florentina, which of Italy or oh, Europe? Um, Olympiacos or oh, Greece? Club Brugge or oh, Belgium? Aston Villa in Italy. So among the top sides, Florentina, which is for Italy, and then Aston Villa or oh, Germany doesn't have anybody here. Now, so watch the Germany teams now. In the first leg, 
buy now could bought two two away at us now dots one i could see two one live across in ash oh no beautiful stuff they are making sure that they are possibly going to go through now in a english Premier League, man city board draw right as that ball draw leave up well lucy aston villa winning west ham lucy so it means that the points for the english Premier League after sa first leg quarter final across europe no it's not good enough and that's why germany has usurped them because germany at least have beaten liverpool with um, have beaten um eat england with one team that is bio for liverpool and watch it team fn west ham two teams actually and a liverpool so well to atlanta back no? for international milan because their teams are doing very well in the smaller european leagues no? for Argentina, didn't lose away uh our team um your friend um, away in the Europa League, they did not lose. Um, Oshie, um Atlanta coming away to come and beat Liverpool. Uh, well, the um, Anfield, right? it's also very huge. So these reasons, you see, so England and Timmy and Bambi, that the Bear Germany, then right now, they are behind them with about 35 points. Oh, 35 points. And I said, Team and friend um, England, England, to close down on uh, on England, on on. on Germany to be able to get that spot for one extra point in the um, to go ahead and get the Champions League places now on. So the top performing leagues, two top countries may receive an additional UCL spot in the 24-25 season. Serie A and Bundesliga would have five teams in a UCL, but a uh, very close. I think that it will go down to the wire, and Chelsea will be hoping set one of these teams, England, a bit to push economy next week. Liverpool will be away to Bergamo. Then West Ham will play at home to Liverpool. If both sides are able to turn it around, now they would have to hope that Man City and Arsenal will go very, very far in the Champions League, possibly play in the final. Uh, in there, very important in there. Of course, if Arsenal are able to triumph over Germany, then it means that Bayern will go out. Then there's going to be some additions for England. And if Atletico de Madrid is it's me, Dots and Fima, Germany points on. I bet you pick a crap, then maybe England can usurp them. It's a, a dicey to go down to the wire. That's the reason. Yeah, Chelsea may qualify on the league club to play in Europe, but most likely, maybe they may not be able to actually play in Europe, given what happens to the various leagues at El Coso. Uh, we'll wait to see all of that goes um, uh, in terms of the players, uh, the teams, and how all of these things unfold. You know? we'll keep a very, 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 very keen eye. Outside conversations and then we self if you might find on YouTube there. Yeah, yeah but bro, all the analysis, all the content, all the um how they say it, all the BBR, BBR updating uh, over here. Thank you very much, sir. Uh my journey and this is just the morning update. I'm here to make will bring you detailed analysis of what has popped up again at 4 p.m. Thank you very much. So choose again. Turn on notification up and choose it. Um all and share link on the end, and subscribe it. Thank you.